guys welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome my name is prestige p and in today's video it's gonna be another valentine's day makeup look look at my face it is so flawless and nice and also this is a definitely a beginner's friendly because i only use two eyeshadows on my eyes and it's not even really an eyeshadow it's a bronzer it's the Fenty Mocha Mommy Bronzer and just a little pop of shimmer on the brow bone and I'm done, okay? And yeah, pretty much it is simple and easy, I promise you. Beginners who want to look good for Valentine's Day or want to try something new, you can go ahead and follow me, trust me. I said it in my previous video, but this makeup look is only for beginners well not really only for beginners but it is like mostly for beginners who want to look good for valentine's day but really don't know or really scared of going over the top this is definitely for you i love this so much i gotta go do my nails today hooray i finally set my appointment i gotta go at three o'clock it is now two o'clock so i have one more hour and i gotta go get my nails done so the next time you're gonna see me my nails will be done trust and believe all right so this is a, another valentine's day makeup look and i hope you enjoy make sure you already subscribe because i do upload monday through friday turn on the bell so you get notified as soon as i upload that was a kind of tongue tie <laughs> but make sure you turn on your bell and yeah let's jump right into this video hi guys hi guys so we're gonna start off with the lips i'm gonna moisturize because my lips was so choppy that day and i'm also gonna go ahead and drink some water because yeah i hardly drink water and i need to start drinking more water i'm gonna go into my moisturizer and my facial crepe um serum and as i said i do rave about this and i don't rave about it because it's for my girl line i rave about it because it's very good and it's also especially good for dry skin so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on and then this is the anti-aging serum and it also have a glow of tint in it so it's really good when you put on your foundation you have a nice glow underneath next i'm going to go ahead and do my brows i'm taking the anastasia beverly hills dip brow in ebony and pretty much what i'm going to do is just you know clean up my brows make sure that it looks much better than the way how it is right now because uh, i don't know my brow just being loosened <laughs> it's just looking weird so i'm just gonna go ahead and just fix it up and to clean up my brows i'm using the ruby kisses in level 14 this is what I currently start using um, because it's really thick and it also have full coverage and this is what I also use for my wigs. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and do that and you guys know that I put my concealer all the way down to my eyelid and then I'm going to use my damp beauty blender just to blend it out. Next I'm going to go into the Fenty and this one is in butter. I'm going to go ahead and set it so that it doesn't crease up on me. I'm gonna go ahead and use a tape and the reason why I am using a tape because I want to have a clean cut shadow and a clean cut um, wing so I just do that just to make sure that it's more cut and looking sharp as ever so I'm gonna go ahead and use my Fenty in Mocha Mommy and the reason why I'm using a bronzer instead of an eyeshadow is because I just want to change it up to be honest um i just want to have a little dementia into the um my eyelid because i really don't want to put too much shadows as i said this is a very natural valentine's day makeup look that a regular person can do if they're not used to makeup so i'm just going to put a little bit just for a little bit of tint onto my eyelid So now I'm going to go ahead into the Patrick Star um, 
palette and this is his first collection with mac and i'm taking that shimmer champagne shade and i'm just going to take that just for the brow bone i just want a little tint of shimmer right underneath the brow bone and pretty much that's about it with these shadows then i'm going to go ahead and use the first brush just to blend it together Next, I'm going to go ahead and use my NYX wing liner and I'm pretty much going to go ahead and do a wing. So now I'm going to go ahead and I really didn't want to do this, but I wanted to try something different with my wing instead of black. I'm going to go ahead and do brown. So I'm taking a brown eyeshadow as I show you right here from the Patrick Star collection with MAC. And I'm going to put it onto a nice thin brush and then pat it right onto the wing. So it's not going to show black anymore. It's going to show kind of like a grayish, darkish brown color. And... I didn't like it at first, but when I finish my whole entire makeup look, I love it. So maybe I keep on doing this, maybe not. But in the meantime, this is what I'm going to do. Now I'm going to go ahead and take off that thing. And as you can see, the line is really cut. But later on, I'm going to go ahead and use my um, concealer and clean it up just a little bit more. But you can see how precise that line is. I'm going to go back into the Ruby Kisses and just clean up the bottom. And I'm also going to take it right underneath my eyes. And it kind of really give it a nice kind of like blended look. And this is also to cover any discoloration and all of that stuff. So I'm going to put it right where the 5 o'clock shadows are. Because I do have hair. You know, sometimes you do have hair but you don't see it until you take pictures and you see a little bit of hair showing out that was like damn i do have mustache what's going on <laughs> so i'm gonna go ahead and do that before i put on my foundation and concealer Next for mascara, I'm going to take my Maybelline mascara and I'm going to go ahead and put that on. And then I'm also going to put my lashes on. The lashes I'll be wearing is called Fluffy. And this is from my hair company, PrestigeMahir.com. It is still sale going on, so make sure you guys check it out. Valentine's sale will end on Valentine's Day. So make sure you guys go ahead and shop. I am fully in stock of all my lashes ready to ship. So if you order today... I will ship it out tomorrow and you will definitely get it for Valentine's Day. Next, I'm going to go into my Huda Beauty and I'm in the shade um, Nutmeg 520G. And I'm going to go ahead and put some onto my face and then blend it out with my damp beauty blender. Now I'm going to go into my Kat Von D and I picked up the shade D35 Neutral and I'm going to go ahead and highlight wherever I normally highlight. Now I'm going to go into my Fenty and this is the shade Butter and I'm going to go ahead and set that. Now 
Then I'm gonna go ahead and do the nutmeg and also the Fenty powder. And I'm gonna go ahead and set the rest of my face and brush off the excess powder under my eyes. Now I'm gonna go into my favorite, you guys already know the drill, Anastasia Beverly Hills in Blush Trio Cocktail Party. Go ahead and put on a little bit of blush. Now this brush, never used it before, but I saw it and I was like, hmm, let me try it out. So I used that for my contour, which I really didn't like, to be honest. Like, it felt weird, but it's really good for your nose contour. So I'm going to go ahead and do the nose contour with that also. Then I'm going to take my Mario Badescus and spray my face. Now for highlight, I'm going to take my e.l.f. in Coffee and Cream and use my fan brush and do a little pop of highlight. Now for lips, I'm going to go in with a regular lip cleanser that I got from the beauty supply store. And then I'm going to take my Maybelline lipstick in the shade um 117 grounded um breaker this is the first time trying this out it's kind of like a reddish orange color i really liked it i really do like it and it felt very comfortable on the lips so i'm gonna go ahead and put that on And then you guys know I have to clean it up because I kind of overdo it. So I'm just using my um, brush and clean it up. Now I'm going to go into the Pat, um, not Patrick Star, sorry, <laughs> Jeffree Star and Morphe. Spray my face and then I am finished. This is the final result. Very simple and easy to do. You can follow me at home and you will definitely get the same result. So thank you guys for watching. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for more video. Turn on your bell and your notification because I do upload Monday through Friday. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.